behind the scenes, behind the lines, inside the stories others won't tell. The Morning Insiders. Concerts are being canceled left and right in Chicago, and given the governor's reopening plan, seeing a big show this summer seems impossible. Sure does, and nonetheless, tickets are still being sold for some really large concerts in August, and the city of Chicago is not ready to roll it out. Morning Insider Tim McNicholas asked fans whether they think the show will go on. Lady Gaga last rocked Wrigley Field in 2017. She said her big return for this summer, August 14th. A link on her website takes you to the MLB's website, where you can still buy tickets for about $200. We're getting tickets soon. We have everything else. Ready. Ricky Magnuson is a teenager from Minnesota who says he already has a flight and hotel room booked. I feel like it would have been canceled by now, since everything else would be canceled, is canceled, that it would have been canceled already with everything else. <laughs> Fans won't know for sure until concert planners and public health officials take off their poker face. According to the governor's five-phase plan, large events can't happen until phase five. And phase five can't happen until we have a widely available and effective treatment, a vaccine, or no new cases over a sustained period. Chicago's public health leader says we are a long way from no new cases, but she's not ready to rule out the August concerts. You know, it's too early to sort of say for sure about anything that hasn't been announced, but broadly speaking, I think we're going to be taking a cautious approach um, generally this summer here in Chicago. There's also a Dan and Shay concert still set for August 15th at the United Center and an August 10th Lindsay Sterling show at Northerly Island. Lady Gaga is the only summer concert date still scheduled at Wrigley Field with several others postponed or canceled. Emily Qualman from New York says she's already paid for her ticket for Lady Gaga and booked a flight to Chicago back in March. I don't think the concert is going to happen, and frankly, I mean, I wouldn't be mad if she postponed it. She's not expecting to just dance at Wrigley this summer, but at least her airline said they'd refund her. Tim McNicholas, CBS2 News. We reached out to the Cubs and we're told any cancellations are up to the artists, not the venue, adding you should hold on to your tickets if you already bought them. We tried to reach Lady Gaga's team for more information, but we have not heard back.